Cat's been fed, and it's time for another edition of Char Hard Gaming with me, Roll Cage TV. Where I do the best I can with what I've got, which is not a lot of talent, but a whole lot of. What do I have a lot of today? Um, uh, keep it on, keep it on, learning, a whole lot of continuing ed, <laughs> continuing education. The old man, old man Roll Cage, trying to do some learning. Watching some more um, tutorials and stuff uh, for this game. Trying to learn a little bit more about it. Uh, this is the uh, Xbox version, the uh, console version of the game, in case you were uh, uh, unclear about that. Um, I am an Xbox gamer. And uh, I've never played this game before. I've never played any other uh, 4X game before. Uh, as they call it, grand strategy game, turn-based strategy uh, game. And uh, so I'm jumping in, jumping in the deep end with the uh, uh, probably one of the more complicated, fully fleshed out uh, games. I was um, uh, looking up the latest expansion. I mentioned something had just come out like a couple months ago or a month ago. Uh, which is true, but that's only come out on the PC. There's been some delays for having for releasing the new the leader pass on um, console. From what I've read, it's um, they. Uh, ugh. Sorry, my phone was not uh, started properly. Uh, they've they've uh, had some delays because the first people that were doing the port were bought out by another company, which was recently bought out by another company and it's just a whole mess so and if, like the everything that that company was doing was it's kind of been on delay so um it it may be a while till the leader pass comes out but supposedly it's going to come out eventually because this anthology version that i bought is supposed to include it uh when you buy the anthology version on any platform it's supposed to include that there isn't a lot with the leader pass. It's just a bunch of new leaders. I guess there's a couple other cards or whatever. Maybe a couple other great people or something. But there isn't a lot of content to be added as far as changes to gameplay or anything like that. So, But I'm still working my way through the standard game. And then uh, there's the Rise and Fall expansion kit and the Gathering Storm expansion kit. But right now I'm still playing a vanilla standard game. This is... Uh, be going to be the fourth YouTube video. If you're watching this on Twitch, I do break these up in YouTube videos, approximately uh, an hour long, a little bit less than an hour, hopefully. And um, first two videos were um, what was I trying to say? The first first two videos are I should put a link to my um, pl uh, 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 playlist. Anyway, I've got a playlist for uh, Civilization VI, and the uh, first two videos are me going through the tutorial, and then uh, at the end of the last stream, I just started on uh, an actual real game, so I'm going to continue on with that and uh, load it up. I've played uh, one turn so far, <laughs> not one turn, i played for about an hour so far. I'm on turn 14, how about that? Still in the ancient era. Anyway, standard rule set. I think it's vanilla, no extra content thing, whatever. And, uh, yeah, I've got all the the uh, downloadable content turned on, but uh, what's available, but it um, doesn't matter because this is, anyway, whatever I'm trying to say. All right. And I have no idea what all those icons mean. Oh, the clock tells me what time it is or something. Yeah, I have the, the anim time animation turned on, so it's, should be uh, middle of the day. It was last time when I was playing, it was middle of the night because that's actually the time of the day that I was playing in the sunset hours. Anyway, let's go ahead and load it up. And uh, I saved it just before taking, just before ending my turn, which is the right time to save it because when I ended my turn, I noticed the scout the that I was next to of life was running water. off. Oh, the this is always so loud in my Stone ears, Age. this voice. I might want to, to turn down the voice sound. To man taking his first upright steps, you have come far. 
now I begins think I've got your them greatest still on quest. Like 100%. From this early cradle of civilization on towards the stars. There I like normally having the voices turned you, up. But you are cunning and full of tricks. I listen through the Your first, charm um, will establish indestructible alliances with the strongest leaders uh, of the world. First YouTube video Keep your and friends uh, the close sound by your side and you will find okay yourself untouchable then. with the so glory of the game prime to win over the world. Different voices are diff are di louder and softer. It seems that these introduction voices are louder than like when the assistant comes on and talks to you or when the other characters come on and talk to you. Anyway, okay, let's continue the game. And uh, yes, up here, the uh, that scout is about to take off when I end my turn. And uh, so I have to know to go chase him. So far, I only have one town, Woolville. I've got uh, one city state here. And uh, uh, it's a culture state. Uh, not going to declare war or level the military. And uh, yeah, so it's culture, culture based. And so far, I'm the only one that has discovered him. And I have one thing. And he's given me a quest. Uh, recruit one great prophet. That's right. I'm trying to find a great prophet. And uh, relationships. Oh, is it? You have a relationship with a different city state? Or is that the city state? Yeah, that's just that's just him. Okay. Um. Yeah. Okay. Huh. Just figuring out what all these buttons do. Oh, why put some marker there? Anyway, I t oh I put um. Tooltips. I set them to. Uh, you have to hit the. Um, uh, use the toggle to turn them on and off. Which I think I'll like better. Because then if I... Because before I had the menu option to say always on and then they got in my way. So uh, this way I can toggle them on and off. I'll usually be wanting them on. Anyway. So trying to remember where I left off. Uh, these guys just took out an encampment. That's right. Uh, and then these guys were noticed by another barbarian. So, uh, yeah, they're, they're going to they're gonna run away. And I'm going to see what direction they run away once I hit the button. So, uh, let's, I guess, let's hit the button. I don't think there's anything else to do. Okay. Aha! Okay, I'm not, I, first of all, I'm going to take these guys. Um, no, I don't want to move that scout. I want to move this scout, okay? And can they get there in one turn? Yeah, I think I think they can get there in one turn, right? Aha. Oh, am I not going to be able to catch him? Oh, it's scout on scout, so he can run away. I don't think I can attack him this turn. No, I still, I have, I only got one movement point left, so I should be able to hit him, right? Yes. Oh, no, I guess I can't do him that turn. Huh. He's going to keep running away from me. I'm going to have, he's going to. I'm going to be chasing him all the way. I thought I had a speed advantage, but no, it's a scout and I'm a scout. So. Okay, and uh, I've got a builder here, and this is where I wanted to build a farm, because I've got an issue with housing. So let me go ahead and build a farm as soon as I can. Oh, good. It didn't make lots of noise. Can I turn that? I think there's a way to turn that off, that auto... Scroll to the next. Maybe I want to do that, though. Yeah, I'll just leave that on for now. Okay. So I've got... Scout 
And I've got my warriors. And do I have um Do I have anything in my queue? I don't think I have anything in my queue, do I? Oh, I've got slingers in my queue, okay. And what about my techno technologies here? Uh, how do I check that? Oh, this way, okay. And I'm, I'm cool with my governments right now. Oh, for 40 gold, I can uh, change my things around in between civics. Otherwise, you can only change these around when you complete a civic, I think. I didn't realize I could use gold to, to do it in between. Um, so, yes, here's the technology. Is this the science? Uh, yes, this is the science. And... Oh, why lets me get information on them? Okay, I was wondering how to do this. Because the tooltips... Okay, so the, maybe I want to just keep the tooltips on all the time. I don't know. So that gives me a little bit of information, but if I hit Y... Oh, okay, it pulls up the... Uh, gives me more information here. Research costs, propagation, lease of technologies, archery... Quotes, that's whole historical. What I want to do is I want to look up things like, I don't know what these other, for example, um, oh, okay, it tells me on the tooltip, building at a Monkai, building library, and district campus. Okay. Anyway, so I need one more turn to do that, and then I will probably... Um, what gets me housing again? Farm a resource. Okay, so I'll get irrigation quickly. Uh, and boost... I think I want this to boost the campus. What am I working towards over here? I don't know. Oh, I want archery. I know I want archery. Kill a unit with a slinger. Okay, well, I'm, re I'm researching this. In one more turn. Uh, at the monkey. I don't know what that is. It's a wonder. Uh, search. It's not telling me. Buildings. Campus. No. Is it... I don't know what it is. Is there a key here somewhere? Ah, show key. Okay. So that is... A... That's not... Okay, that's a building. Building library, building at the... Okay. Well, the library, I think, is the first one. I don't know what the second one is. is that a... Oh, ETE. Okay. ETE? Aha! I misspelled it. Uh, must be built on floodplains or marsh. Okay, I don't think I have floodplains or marsh anywhere near me. So that's not going to help me. Uh, not sure what it does. Plus two science. Okay. But this lets me build the uh, campus district. 
which I think is important for trade routes. That's what I want. I want that for trade routes. I think that's important. Okay. Uh, that's something to look forward to. And then here, that's the research panel. That's for science civics panel. And right now I'm working on craftsmanship. I never even noticed that these Ys came up before. That's cool. And what I want to try to do is race towards political philosophy. And so I can get there through state workforce after I finish craftsmanship. Yes. So let's cue this up. Um, okay, how do I cue this up? Good, uh, do I just click on it here or can I not cue it? Ah, add to queue. Okay. Okay. Oh, wait. I've got both of these going? Now, what am I researching right now? Um... I'm researching craftsmanship in two turns. Or no, that's... In five turns, craftsmanship will be done. And I want to improve three tiles before I get there. So... Let's remove this from the queue. No. I need that in the queue to get state workforce. Okay. Oh, this allows the construction of trade routes. What else? What was I thinking about? Oh, I'm doing craftsmanship now. No. What? Here it's telling me craftsmanship. Oh, foreign trade is at the top. Okay, craftsmanship is next in my queue. And then I should have state workforce in my queue when that's done. Yes, and I want the foreign trade. And I've only got five turns to build it. Oh, but this is... Did I build the three tiles already? Because it's only going to take me ten turns. I think it looks like I've already got it 50%. No. Did I improve my three tiles? No, that's hollow. Okay. It's not filled in, it's hollow, so that tells me. I haven't done it yet. Or something like that. I have no idea what all this means. I thought I had understood this. Alright. Well, I've got my queue set there. I know where I'm going to go there. As far as my research panel. Um, what am I working on now? I have animal husbandry. I'm working on pottery? Why did I want to work on pottery next? Well, it's going to be completed in one turn. So let's add this to the queue, archery, which I think is more important. Oh no, what was I saying? Writing was next. Um, do I know where any horses are? Kill a unit with a slinger. Meet another civilization. I haven't done that yet. Have I? No. Okay. Well, I got one turn to decide this. I have to think about it. This will let me set up a new district, which is important. I think 
because that helps me with um, my housing crisis. Is that right? Um, I've got my amenity. Palace trading. Okay. Did I not have... Was I not... Do I not have a housing crisis anymore? Because I made this... Where did I see that I had a housing crisis? I've got two citizens going. Was I thinking about uh, something else? Maybe I was thinking about... Ugh! I'm so confused all the time! Okay, well... They want me to move stuff. So I'm going to move stuff. Um, I think I want to... I would like to find a river. That's why I was moving this way with one unit. But I'm going to bring... Um, yeah, I'm going to bring the, uh, the war guys back, and I'll continue. Oh, but see, I'm close to the... Am I going to find a river down here? Up here? I'm close to the North Pole. Um, yeah... This looks like it would be a good place to settle another civilization, but I would like to find a river for my second civilization. Okay, well. Let's go ahead and keep this guy going, I guess. Crab. I wish that there isn't a good way to turn those things off. I've got to do this and then go to options because toggle tooltips, but I wish there was a way to. Is map select in there? No, I don't think so. Okay, that was lets me select my unit. I want to be able. I want to because it's covering up the number there. Boom and cost one. Okay. Oh, I've got this thing on. That's right. I've got the outline. It tells me if it's only going to take one turn. Okay, he's done. Now these guys are going to come back home because I've got the other scouts moving uh, away. I might as well because these are hexagons. And down this way. Because I can go like here, here, and then across. It's still going to take me the same number of turns if I go that way. So let's go down here. Discover a little bit more. Okay, next turn. I'm going to keep my eye on that scout because I want to go get him. We have yeah, trained seems... our first ranged unit, capable of hitting oh. enemies from afar, while out of the range of hand-to-hand -hand combat. Okay. Tell me more. I... I guess I got Slinger, right? Five combat-oriented stats. Hit points, combat strength, range strength, bombard strength, and range. All units have 100 hit points, which is convenient, but confusing if you're playing... <laughs> Pretty much any other game, they have variable hit points, which, which is their defense. But here, there is no defense. You just compare strength on strength. Uh, all military units have a combat strength. Melee units use their combat strength when attacking or defending. Ring units use their combat strength when defending. Otherwise, their range strength. Um, 
So the range strength statistic, this number is compared with the target's combat strength to determine the results of the attack. Land units with a range strength can also attack direct defenses, but at a reduced effectiveness. Um, okay. Bombard strength is the anti-district strength of a unit. Units with bombard strength can also attack units, but at a reduced effectiveness. So they, oh, it's an anti-district strength. Okay, so you can attack districts as well as cities. Huh? Uh, land units cannot have both a bombard and range strength, but naval units essentially function as both bombard and ranged units. Oh, okay. Well, that's good. Range stats determine the distance which the unit can attack. Range of two means the target can be in an adjacent tile or one tile distant. Range of one would mean that the target has to be adjacent to the attacker. Okay. Some units have an anti-air combat value. These units automatically defend against air attacks. In the end, uh, yeah, I'm a long way from air attacks, but okay. I and I completed pottery. Okay. And I was going to. Was I going to have to decide from there what? Plus two housing if I build a granary. Okay. Um. Do I need to put that in a district? I don't know. I can find out. I thought clay must feel... A thought clay must feel happy in the good potter's hands. A thought clay. Okay. <laughs> Who said that? That's ridiculous. <laughs> okay. Um, so let's go to my city right away. Which I can do rapidly by doing this right no i can't go to the city well i can go to the slinger which is in the city and i'm supposed to kill a unit with a slinger but i don't know where a slinger is yet so if i kill a unit with a slinger i can get the archery so i'm probably going to want to go south um just because there isn't much else north Okay, and the builder, what was the builder going to build? Um, I wish I knew what the housing thing was. Let me go back here. Oh, there's, there's got to be a way. Um, Okay, I got... Two, yes, I have two houses. I need three to keep everybody happy. So, can the builder build a greenery somewhere? Or is that the city that builds the greenery? Uh, let's build this. Uh, great people. I don't know if I can get a great people yet. I'm not sure what great people I wanted. Cannot recruit. Gotta have to have Coastal City. <laughs> Anyone cheap? I want a great person to uh, fulfill that thing. I know, quite a few of these are cheap. But I don't have the resources yet for it. Yeah, I don't have close enough to recruit any of these people yet. Um, and I don't have any recruitment points for anybody. How do I get recruitment points again? Uh, right here. Great people, look at there, it's right at the top. Introduction. Oh, uh, great person, individual writer, great industry, great generals. Yeah, okay, it doesn't tell me how to get great people.
Yeah, it's just telling me there's a way to get points towards a great person. I don't know what they are. I don't remember. Okay. Um, I need more science. Kill a unit with a slinger or... Let me look at the tree again. So I gotta decide which I want. Let's go to the builder first of all. Because I think I can build a granary somewhere, right? Oh no, that, I was gonna go here to see if granary is something I could build. Granary! I can build it in the city center. Okay. Six turns. Yes, let's build a granary. That will increase my housing, which will leave me on my housing. Oh, does a monument also give me... Uh, not the technology tree. I wanted... No, this is plus two housing. Okay. Why well, we'll do that. And so the builder can build something else. Farms or... Oh, that's a luxury resource. I don't have to build anything on there. I don't have hills near me. So he can't build a mine, which is what I'd really like to build. Hmm. Actually, if I build another farm, that will also solve my... Um... Now, if I build... Can I build a farm on... And is it going to tell me it'll remove the... No. Oh, my knowledge of irrigation events. Oh, that's right, because I had two... Got it. I improved. Did I improve the three squares? I need to improve another square. And they've got one more build in them. And... Oh, no, I only had one left. Okay, these are my warriors. Oh, that's right, I'm in the wrong place. Ah! Okay, so the 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 uh, other thing is still there. So that's cool. But I've only improved three square. I've only improved two squares. I need to improve one other square. And these guys are my friends. Okay. Well, I have to pick one of these. Irrigation would probably be very good, but irrigation doesn't help me towards anything else. Writing lets me build a district. And I haven't met another civilization yet. This has been boosted. It unlocks hanging gardens. Oh, is that a wonder? Where do I build that? Uh... Um, 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 store irrigation unlocks. Yeah, and they just show me. <laughs> they don't tell me what those icons mean. I don't know what they mean. Okay, search. Okay. Uh, hit the run button. Hanging gardens. What does that do for me? Gardens, maybe 
I mean, everything that exists, much less than a wonder. Oh, Babylonians. Okay. Must be built next to a river. Ugh! Well, that doesn't help me because I don't find any rivers. This is a really depressing place. Okay, I'll hold off on that. Archery will let me upgrade. And, uh, but I have to find a unit with that slinger to kill. Otherwise, building a district. Uh, I haven't found any horses either. All right, let's start on this. And now it's just units to move. Why is it still looking dark? It's 1.13 p.m. Maybe that's just in my game? It says up in the corner, 1.13. Hmm. Um, okay, well, I'm still moving him this way, I guess. I'm beginning to give up on this uh, whole idea of finding a river. Okay. And these guys, warriors, move them this way. And the slingers. Oh, they've moved already. Okay. I could give them... No, I'm not going to give them death. <laughs> okay, done with this turn, then. Oh, wait. Um... Yes, these guys... Why was it telling me... Because I didn't have to move the scout? Okay, yes, I want to hit this guy again. Can I do it? I think I can. Yes, I think I'm going to get him. Oh, but now he's going to move. Oh, he can't move away because he's in my zone of control? Or can he still move away? Well, he can't move away unless he goes across the water. And he can't go across the water, so I've got him cornered. Okay, so I'll be able to get him next turn. Yeah, see, because he started in my zone of control, so he can't move away from my zone of control. Um, is that Oslo? Yes, also coast. Ah, I need to find a river. I'm not going to find any rivers up here, am I? Ugh. Um, you, finish them off. Got them. Me and my cats are happy now. I'm go pet my cat. Oh, I didn't, do I need a moment point to pet my cat? It's my other unit. It, maybe petting is supposed to do something other than... I moved all of these guys, didn't I? Yeah, these guys are getting really far afield. Ah, okay, here. This guy, he has more movement. And I don't know what. One does not simply pet a cat. Yeah, does that... If you have a dog, does that heal you? Well, I'm not going to have dogs. I'm Egyptian. Okay, well... Uh, yeah, I'm giving up. Let me follow this course. Coast down south. Whoops. These guys, they're the warriors. If I find a civilization with the warrior, that's not going to put me in good stead. But actually, 
I should be able to see. Yeah, because there'll be a dashed line at the end of one of those hexes if I'm close. At the end of my, what I can see. Oh, there's a Barbarian Scout. Oh, you done messed up. I'm going to get that. He's going to try to run away. I'm not going to take him out one turn. But... Okay, and the Builder. What did I say I wanted to build with him? I've got two improvements, so I guess another farm is all I can do. But does that also improve... Oh, I was going to build a pasture up here, but I had, couldn't... That's what, I was having a problem with the pasture up here. Oh, it's already being worked, but if I build a pasture, that will improve it. Will it not? I had the, it told me I like had to clear the land first. Um, yeah, right now there's nothing. Oh. Oh, I can remove the improvements. Oh, that's interesting. Okay, I don't want to do that. I'm going to move him to here. And the warrior is moving. I guess I'll move him this way to cut off the, um, to try to cut off those, uh, that scout. And maybe my city-state guys will help me anyway. Okay, that's good. Next turn. No, he's not helping me with the scout. Oh, the scout's going to attack me. Well, I have poor defense, but... Uh, I should be able to take them on. Can I finish them off? How badly am I hurt? Um... Melee strength, range strength 15. Oh yeah, I should finish him off. And I'm hardly damaged. The scout didn't damage you very much at all. I got him, and I got my boost on archery. Okay. Oh, and I got my boost on bronze working. What was the boost on archery? I gotta look that up. That's this one, right? Oh, not my boost on archery. The boost on whatever that other one was. Oh, kill three barbarians. Oh, that was a barbarian I killed? Oh, I thought that was a scout. Wasn't it a scout? Bronze working, yeah. Oh. Huh. Cool. Alright. Who else do I need to move? These guys. They were moving south. I'm trying to remember what everybody was moving to. Um. Guess here. Yes. And... These guys, I could find that barbarian encampment, maybe. Okay, and the scout. Which scout is highlighted? Oh, this scout can move farther. Okay. And this scout now, he's going to scout this way. Boy, there's some good lands here. 
there's copper I can mine. But I'm going to need to find that. Use that uh, other science thingy. Oi, Aminatur. Nobiaguanan Malikalina. Ofriaka Marhaba Loko Gab Loko. Terfra Hilton Onamina. Excellent. Yes, would you like to visit our nearby city? Sure. I found her with a scout. So, uh. Ooh. Ow. Where did I find her? Oh, this is the new BM. Okay. Uh, after meeting another civilization, your writing has advanced. And that's what I was uh, researching now. So cool. And where is her? Where is her civilization? Oh, she's in... She's going to my city, but I'm not going to her city yet. So let's uh, talk to her. Um, I have... Uh, uh, does this show the friendship? Relationship neutral. Uh, raise your access level. You could research the printing technology, establish a trade route, send a delegation, or establish an embassy. I'll try to send a delegation. Oh, here it is. Plus one for an unknown reason. That's because I found her with a scout. So let's go ahead and send a delegation. Oh, you don't want to. How about if I declare friendship first? Okay, I need more than one city planner. Always tries to keep the maximum number of districts in each city. Respect other civilizations who also develop their cities in this fashion. Okay, so maybe if I develop that district, which I'm working towards... Meta civilization, unit available for promotion. Oh, cool. And I think I just got, oh, I can't promote. Yeah, promote, promotion available, okay. Um, range strength versus land units or combat strength when occupying either an improvement that provides defensive strength or district. Uh, well, I think I'll take the range strength. <laughs> Okay, and tech boosted writing. I got writing. Okay. Okay. Um. Your knowledge of writing has advanced considerably. Okay. Boosted. Oh, that's just telling me that I got boosted. Okay. So, if I go to my city... Actually, I don't have to do it that way. I can do it this way. Because I only have one city to pick from. Or research is always just... Let's see. What? No, I do want to go... I do need to go to my city to look up uh, the production. And I think nothing's in the queue right now. Right? I think it's going to tell me nothing's in the queue. It says Q0. Oh, it's working towards building a granary. That's at the very top. I don't ever notice it's at the very top. Okay, it's going to take me three more turns to get the granary. Um, have I gotten the... No. Now I need four houses. Okay. Well, once the granary is done, that'll get me the four houses. So everyone will be happy. Uh, okay. Let's 
scout. Scout, come this way. Oh, he found the coast again. Um, so, this guy... He's a little hurt, but not bad hurt. Okay. And... Builder! Okay, he was going to try to build... Get, there's gold there? A camp is for military unit benefit, right? I thought the deer was... Deer is just a bonus resource. Okay. That's not, so I can't create a pasture there. Okay. But I can create a campment, and that also gives me plus five housing. Okay. Yes, and now I got craftsmanship because I got the three cities. Okay. I gotta build a district. Um, okay. I can't remember how to build a district again. It's not the technology tree. Oh, I actually have to do it in the city. It's this. Yeah, watching videos on uh, how uh, <laughs> the PC version works doesn't help. Okay, so I guess I need a builder to build a district. Because I can build a district now. But that means I'm going to need another builder. How do I build districts? Uh, no, that's the wrong tree. Is it the civics tree? No, that's what I just opened. Oh, I haven't... Right. Right, I haven't finished writing yet. Okay. Let's move my last unit. Oh, he's got one more place to move, huh? Um... Well, he won't move till next turn. I'm not going to skip my turn. And he's moving... This way? Move to. Okay. That was weird. Uh, let's move down a little bit. Oh! Is that Barbarians? Yes, it is! Oh, and there's a barbarian there too. Okay. Uh, why did I not see him already? He was already there. Well, the slingers are going to have to go and attack them. But I can't attack them this turn. And there's an encampment. Oh, and there's. Oh, are those the Nubians? Yes, the Nubian warrior. Okay, that's where I met the Nubians. They're off that way somewhere. Maybe the Nubians will attack that encampment. I won't have to deal with it. Because I'm not going to take them out. Uh, what do they have? 
uh, Spearmen. Yeah. Scout's not going to be able to take out the Spearmen. Okay. Well, I'm going to end this episode here, I think. Take a quick break. Because it's been almost an hour. And uh, I will... If you're watching on Twitch, I'll throw up the BRB screen. And if you are watching on YouTube, I will end the uh, YouTube video here. So uh, I'll see you in the next video. Either way, I will uh, see you when I see you.